So no, brushing hard can actually hurt your teeth. It can hurt your gum tissue as well. Um, it can kind of wear away at the tooth structure and abrade your gum tissues and make them really irritated. We actually want you to kind of pull back a little bit instead of brushing hard and give your teeth a little massage when you're brushing. False. Yes, the teeth will be clean, but the gums will be red and they'll probably be puffy and bleeding. And your gums are your long-term indicators of good brushing. So absolutely we can tell if you've been brushing well before your appointment. Even if you brush really well right beforehand, if you haven't before that, your gums will tell us. No, no aspirin. Don't suck on an aspirin, it's horrible. It's an acid that will actually leave a burn on the, on the tissue, so do not suck on an aspirin. Worst, worst idea ever. Cavities and baby teeth definitely matter. Your baby teeth, yeah, they're gonna fall out eventually, but they're holding place for those adult teeth that are gonna be there for the rest of your life. They're developing that environment that your adult teeth are gonna grow into. Um, and also, if you have cavities in your baby teeth, and they can become really painful. You can have some kids that have pain, swelling, infection. That can make the adult teeth have an environment that's really unhealthy. And also, we want you to have really good habits in place right now um, as a kid so that when you're older, it's not as hard to continue those good habits. False. Quite often a parent says to me their baby teeth were perfectly straight with no gaps. And that's actually not a good thing. You want to have gaps between the baby's front teeth so that the much, much bigger permanent teeth can fill in those areas. If not, there'll be no spacing. So it is false if the baby teeth are perfectly straight and there are no gaps that the permanent ones will come in perfectly. Is the tooth fairy real? Absolutely. We send notes to her all the time. We get emails. We send her. Yeah, we keep in touch with the tooth fairy. We never know what the tooth fairy is going to leave though. Sometimes she's in a good mood, sometimes she's not. You just never know. <laughs>